So this next segment that you guys are just about to watch, this is again Deborah Weiss lying completely to these people and trying to manipulate them and trying to hold them hostage. Now, the date of this video was January 3rd. And I'll tell you guys, I have run an ISP, an internet service provider, all my adult life. Before I started working at Google, my wife and I, Nicole, we were running ISPs all over Oregon, uh, Washington, uh, we've been in Montana, all over the place. We were doing lots of ISPs. And so we are an internet service provider. We know how the internet world works. Now, the first and foremost thing is if somebody calls in and says, I'm having issues with my internet, or can you tell me something about the bill? You absolutely, without a shadow of a doubt, have to qualify who they are. You have to get their first last name. You have to get their address and some sort of verification that it is who it is because you would be reading off personal information that you can't just call in. So when Deborah Weiss goes in here and says, first of all, the truth is this account was under Rachel's name. That was one of the ex-postal workers. And this is how that the Howie Scriptures works. They put all these accounts under all of their slaves, the people who they use as postal workers, and they, they, they don't have their names on anything at all. So the internet was under an ex-postal worker's name, and they can't get it out because they aren't Rachel. And so when Deborah Weiss tells these people that she's called up and that all of the, they've told them all about this downloads and it's all about the streaming, number one, it's very, very doubtful they would have those kind of records on um, record to begin with without having to do other forensic stuff to bring that stuff in. Most ISPs don't. Um, if you're trying to track exactly what people are doing, you would have to have a different tier look at it. Everything she's saying is a lie. She's not going to be able to call. Um, this is actually um, HughesNet, um, satellite internet. And they would call them and she can't verify it. So again, she is lying and manipulating these people. And what I find even more creepy and bizarre is on January 3rd, I was deep into hunting for these people. I was deep into hunting for the postal agents. And so I had all of these videos all over YouTube. And so Deborah Weiss didn't want these postal agents to get a load of any of these videos. And so she was cutting them off of internet. And this is why she spun this big lie about, oh, it's all this stream and it's all this other stuff. 100 gigabits is really a small plan when you're dealing with a ton of people and you're trying to run a business off of it. It's not a lot. And so, again, this is the mind manipulation and the evil that this woman, Deborah Weiss, and the Hallelujah Scriptures does on the backs of everybody and has been successful at it for so many years. So, guys, this little family is very worth the support. This little family was able to document all of this great evil and expose the Hallelujah Scriptures once and for all. When all of this information comes out, they need to be arrested. In fact, we have enough case loads that I believe the FBI should involve. Definitely the DA um, in New Jersey is involved. We probably have a crime in Arkansas now. So there's crimes everywhere, and definitely in New Zealand. There's international money laundering, wire fraud, uh, racketeering. There's a lot of different crimes that these people need to be accountable for. Now, they have fallen upon their own curses. They are the ones who are responsible for this because they've spent 13 years lying to people and telling people they've been getting Bibles out. That's a lie. When these families are able to go on the record, which will be very soon, you guys will hear everything that I've been saying. You will hear it right from their mouths from people that were deep in the trenches with this evil, vile set of demon vipers. And so, guys, we need to pass this around. Everybody needs to know this is how these people operate. From a Torah standpoint and a Torah community, we need to stop them. And then we need to get this into the police hands. This is who needs to deal with this stuff. If, it, if we don't deal with these people, if we do not stop them, then they will continue defrauding all of these people in the name of our creator for a long time. This is where we have to make a stop and this is where we have to get it going. So guys, here is a little uh, six minute uh, clip of again, Deborah Wessel's psychological manipulation and um, attacks against little family. I did say to brother Aaron to wait, you know, because if we can't hold up orders, I mean, that's the number one. If we've got issues with your internet for the last two months, you should be on it every single day for the phone to these people to sort it out because we can't hold up people's orders. Yeah, we need to get it out of we Rachel's just, name because it's in Rachel's name. We can't, they won't tell us anything. I don't, I know. So I'm going to sort this all out myself. And that's what we're going to talk about today. But, uh, 
I think one of the issues is, is we need maybe we just need you to be like if something's wrong, uh, ring the people, ring the people, ring the, just continue to fix. They won't know, tell us anything until out it's out of her out. name, though. I know. So and we can't I, ring her. We can't. <laughs> we can't. I know. But hey, I haven't finished. I haven't finished. Please, I haven't finished. So what I'm saying is if it's an issue and you can't fix it, then go elsewhere and see what other solutions are. Just say, because Aaron said this, this, this name. Just go and get it. Get get the costings and email us. That's all you do. So I went okay. to, to ABC Internet Place. I found that they're the better people. Here's the cost each month. This is what we get. Can we change that? That's all you have to do. It's best just to think think ahead of things and go, okay, we've got a situation here with this internet. We need the internet. If we don't have the internet, we can't do our work. So here, here's a solution. Um, we need you to be able to do that because we're working just as big hours as well with a big responsibility. So we've got to try and do other things for, you know, that has to be done for the sector. <laughs> Like it would be amazing and help us, all of us. Well, what I've heard is uh, that we do know that the Internet is quicker from 2 to whatever it is in the morning, but I feel like we need to make sure that during the day uh, it's adequate. And, and what I was wondering, too, is um, does everybody there have a smartphone? Because it may be that uh, if... Ethan and Olivia and Clinton and all of them are, are uh, say, uh, looking at uh, YouTube videos or self-help or whatever, that all of that eats up into the data plan and probably would slow everything down. So it might be that if, the, if that's going on, you'd want to do that in the overnight hours and, uh, and make sure that the only thing that's drawing on the uh, Wi-Fi is uh is are the uh, the project uh, things does that make sense yeah so um i have thought about that and i have instructed everybody to stay off the wi-fi as much as possible Sorry, Aaron, I can't hear you. um i have thought about that and i have inst- when, I, when i ring up go ahead Aaron. Uh, you're breaking up Aaron, but try it again oh. buddy um, I have thought of that, and I have instructed everybody here to basically use the Wi-Fi as minimally as possible um, until the situation gets resolved. And there, there are like small things that we use, like um, there's a chat app that we use to um, talk to each other with that it shouldn't take up very much, but I wouldn't think so. No. Um, so just things like that, and then we might, um, like, I might send, like, pictures from my phone or things like that, but I've been having everybody keep all of the extras to a minimum. Well, before this, we were all sending pictures from our phone, our phones to right, keep up the work. Right, right, yeah. And that was all going over Wi-Fi, too. Yeah. Yeah, when I sp- when I spoke to the lady at um, on, sorry, brother Robert, when I spoke to her lady, because I've got to get this shut down, this account and reopen it. So I want to talk about that before I did that. So I told her I'll ring her in a couple of days. When I spoke to her though, she was lovely. She looked into the system and she said there's quite a large amount of downloading, pictures, viewing. St- I don't know nothing about this because I don't the do pictures. this, but I'm just saying. She said she saw a lot of streaming and that. I said oh, I don't think so. I don't think these people are like that. She said well I can see it all the downloads and things. She said that is eating up your data and then it becomes very slow. So yeah, they, maybe um, they so told maybe me the what same Brother Robert mentioned. Okay. Um, they told me the same thing about the um, virtual calling. So I don't know why they would be telling us different things. Um, 
But uh, since I then, to, I spoke to a lady that was in, in charge because that person that I dealt with trying to change her account was no good. So I spoke to somebody in charge, and she went through thoroughly through the whole system with me. And I spent over an hour with her on the phone only two days ago, and um, she's given me her personal phone number um, and everything about this whole whole situation because we've got to shut this thing down. But I've got to got to figure out in my head when we when we talk through this. Um, when we can do this maybe i don't know maybe somebody could go into town with you and they could send out whatever i don't know what but she said there's a lot of streaming so maybe you know we could just stick to one phone or one something that well, because we're just we're reading it for the about. world that's basically what we were just talking about if if anybody is looking at anything on a wi-fi thing uh during business hours it would be taking away from the the, uh, the speed of the micro uh, millibytes per second or whatever it is, and but I mean it, it's it's it, when she says downloading, it could be the I'm sorry streaming, the, the, oh, sorry, streaming. The, so not downloading well, streaming 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 would include like a YouTube video or so 